Tonight, on Safari Into Darkness, we travel in Safari Cave to find the elusive, completely 100% daintily dangerous orange skin salamander and many other terrible creatures as we travel into what may possibly be the home of what is known as the Forshi Fright. I'm Gregory Pendunspums and this is Safari Into Darkness. Have you ever wondered about what lies out there in the great beyond your sitting room? Then come with me on an adventure to the deepest, darkest regions of the earth. Follow me on my quest to reclaim lost and hidden relics. Join me in a journey to the habitats of rare and mysterious animals. I'm Gregory Pendunspumps, and this is Safari Into Darkness. Good night, mate! Welcome to Safari Into Darkness. I'm your host, Gregory Pendunspums, and behind the camera is trustworthy Josephine. Hello! And joining us today is my nephew, Billy. Hello! We are here in Camp Forshi, near the Tennessee-Kentucky border, and while in the dining hall, I happen to make a discovery. You see, as I came in here the other day, I was looking at this old map of the camp, and I noticed, right up here on the back end, there was a thing that said, Cave Spring. All of a sudden, I began to realize I had heard that in this land there were legends of the mysterious orange skin salamander. And so, I was thinking, this would be the perfect place to see if we could find one. So I thought, this would be a perfect time for a safari in the darkness. Here we stand at the trailhead, which begins the trail deep into the heart of the forest. We will soon travel within it to find the cave of Forshi, where lives the orange skin salamander. It is here that our safari into darkness truly begins. Well, we have come up to this trailblazer and we're a little unsure about which way to go. So, uh, we're going to take a little break and during this time of trying to figure out what's the best way to go, you can watch some of these commercials and see our sponsors. We'll catch up with you again on Safari Into Darkness. Bobby Joe's Beans. They are real good. This is not a real product. Do not go looking for it in your local store. As you can see, as we were coming along this trail, we found this bleeding tree. That's not a very good sign. Not at all. It's actually quite bad, making me a little nervous. Let's, uh... Let's run! Ah! Oh, trailblazer! Trailblazer! The anxious, mystical trailblazer of old. <sighs> That's trailblazer. That's the trailblazer. Okay, run! <laughs> so, according to the map, we got on this trail and we've just started walking. Um. I hope we're on the right trail. It should be fairly simple to find it, but you know I am a great person. I can I can find anything and oh look at this graffiti. Wow, and the people's been there before. You see, we can follow what we've learned from our ancestors who have, are the great old Hopewell Indians who have carved this and we'll use this to find the location of the cave where we may find the orange skin salamander. Um, Gregory, I, I don't think there are any people, I ancient Indians, whose names are Heather and Shane. I don't think those were names back then. According to my calculations, the cave should be right down there, down this really steep slope. Ought to be pretty easy getting down there. Uh, are you sure, sure you can do it? Sure, of course I'm sure. Back in my old school, in the old country, they called me the Little Mountain Goat because I was so skilled at slopes. Okay, I'm all the way down, made it this far. Ha, 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 Well, as you can see, we finally made it down to the cave after that embarrassing little bit up there, but as we're standing here, we're getting attacked by mosquitoes. The cause is over here. 
where this little spring coming out of the cave and this other coming over here to this bulky of stagnant water. And in the stagnant water, the mosquitoes lay their eggs and they just hatch so they're all over the place. They're attacking everything and every body. My bug spray is starting to wear off. I mean, I hope this won't be too much of a problem. You lucky viewers on the other side of the screen really don't know what I'm talking about or going through. No, 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 no! Gary, Gary! Don't What, me. what Billy? Don't what? Me. What? Uh, oh, oh, he, um, some, some madness has taken over Billy. We'll be back. So, yeah. Alright, I'm fixing to go into the cave. The cave of Forshi. It's reputed to be the home of the, what's known as the Forshi Fright. I'm fixing to go in to find the elusive orange skin salamander. Going in. Okay. Ugh. Okay, there's lots of sharp stuff all over the place. Okay, this isn't on. How does this turn on? Okay, there we go. All you can probably see right now is my guns, but that's you got to deal with that. Okay, owie! So as it starts to go out, it forms these sharp little shards. So you want to be careful of those. I'm, they're poking the crud out of me. Make it oh, that hurts. So look, wow, this goes really, really far back in here. I can hear water running. This, you know, this place is reputed to be the home of the four sheep fright, which is a terrible ghost that just pops up and disappears. It's like you don't see it anymore. I really hope that I don't run into that thing when I'm looking at oh, that's so pretty in here. But I really hope I don't run into the four sheep fright while I'm back here. Ah, yeah! I uh, had a bit of a brush in with what I thought was the full sheep fright, but not too sure now. It just kind of popped up and disappeared. So I'm a little bit scared right now. Oh, oh! I found them! I found the orange, the orange skin salamanders. There's four of them right here. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh, that is so amazing. Wow. You know, it's getting the Poo scared out of me, it's quite worth it now seeing such beautiful, elegant creatures. Wow! Well, this has been another great adventure. Let's see. Uh, but it's now time to close. I'm quite tired. Say goodnight, Billy. Goodnight. Say goodnight, Josephine. Goodnight! Alright, well, goodnight, folks. I'm going to settle in for a nice little nap. This has been Safari Into Darkness. Ah, mosquitoes!